Santa knows where all the best toys are, and this December, many of the hottest smartphones are just a penny with service at Appalachian Wireless. Stop by your local Appalachian Wireless to check out all of the great smartphone deals that consistently top the nice lists. Oh, oh, this Christmas is truly going to be bigger and better than ever. Better service, bigger savings, that is. Ho, 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 ho. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. A Pikeville City Commission meeting was held on Monday night. One of the topics of discussion was a first reading of a proposed 1% restaurant tax. Now this restaurant tax will be used to offset tourism expenses already being spent through the general fund in an effort to pave the way for the broadband future for Pikeville. We have to have that edge as to why industry would be willing to locate to Eastern Kentucky where there's candidly no uh, highway system, there's no uh, commercial air service, there's all those things that industry would normally rely upon, we don't have. So the one uh, really golden opportunity that if we don't take advantage of it, then shame on us is this broadband initiative. It's the dark fire, the latest and greatest uh, broadband opportunity in our currently in our nation. To fund the dark fiber broadband initiative, the city plans to add an additional 1% to the current 2% restaurant tax. The intent of the restaurant tax is, is to create again another re a regional tax, 10 cents on a $10 meal is what we're talking about, that will be in, that will go into the city's budget. The intent is to go into our existing budget and to pull out all the things in the general fund that we're paying for that are tourism related. So if, it, if we generate $100,000 in restaurant tax, then we'll pull out $100,000 out of the general fund and earmark that money specifically towards the growth of this uh, initiative, this broadband. With the tax in place, the hope is the city will be able to position itself to fund in stages dark fiber broadband development. All of this is in play to set, us, set, to set Pikeville up to be possibly the first, we hope, uh, to take advantage of the superhighway of internet which will open us up to trade opportunity, will open us up to be able to market uh, to outside industry, that we have gigabit uh, capability, which is known in the industry as a Google standard. And industry are looking at communities that have Google standard. A second reading of that proposed restaurant tax will take place next Thursday at a special called meeting of the Pikeville City Commission. Reporting from Pikeville, for EKB News, I'm Jackson Latta.